Hello, 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 everybody. What is going on? I know I've been missing, have I not? I've been missing you all. Man, I didn't realize I was gone that long. It was almost like a YouTube vacation. An unexpected vacation. Okay, well, you know what? We have a lot to catch up on, and let's get started on what we need to talk about as far as weighing in today. Can we actually lose weight in jumping, rope, skipping, doing whatever we need to do? I had just put out a video not too long ago in jumping rope for 30 days. Whew, yeah, I am so glad that I waited. The you know, the little time that I waited because now I can come back with a little bit more information instead of giving you the results right after the video. So let's get started. So the main thing I can tell you is that when you get ready to jump, make sure that you have comfortable shoes and comfortable clothing so you will be able to continue on jumping. Make sure that you have a good sports bra on that will support the girls. And it will help if you have a jump rope that can count so you don't have to count yourself. And if you get ready to start jumping, uh, and if it's your first time, make sure you do exercises to, you know, flex your legs and ankles and do some stretches so you don't injure yourself. Once again, all I'm telling you is what I did and was my, uh, this is my experience. And I'm not telling you to do what I did, but letting you know that it helps. Okay, uh, and plus check with your doctor before you start doing any type of exercise. Um, when you get ready to jump, you truly need to listen to your body. I think that I could have lost a whole lot more weight if I would have eaten a little bit better in the beginning. I was eating, but not, it didn't come together with that taste bud and working out like it normally do. It was like, it, didn't come together until the 24th. The 24th to the end of June the 3rd is when I started eating more clean and doing intermittent fasting. And I actually seen the difference as far as on the scale. And I was impressed with that. What I did uh, learn about myself is that my calves muscles was much stronger and my waistline is smaller uh, it has shrunk okay um, every day that i jump i jump to the point that i was getting better each day and i wanted to jump even more uh, jumping is a overall workout and so when you jump it's working everything from your arms, your shoulders, your, all up in here is jumping and moving, your calves, your muscles, and everything. Everything is getting worked out. So for 30 days, I worked every 5, 10, 15 minutes from my jump from 1,000, 1,200, 15, 2,000 jumps. I did whatever I want, however I felt. And I just wanted to come and share with you all. Whatever you do, make sure if you're going to jump, jump on a mat or grass if you can. I could not jump on the grass. The grass, for some reason, I had a hard time. Uh, the grass, uh, the yard is not level, and I can tell. Even if you're on the concrete, it's not level. Some of my, some of my concrete wasn't level, I can tell. But that concrete, y'all, is not good for the joints. I did jump on the concrete and it wasn't good for me. I'm going to tell you, it wasn't, wasn't, even though you see me do it, it was not good. Okay, so okay. just try to prevent that concrete. I was jumping on a yoga mat and the yoga mat was okay, but it seemed like I had got used to jumping on the concrete and it was better, but it's not. Uh, I have another type of mat that I used to jump on. This one here is a whole lot better. And this is the one I will continue on jumping on. Now, what I have learned that now, 
I, I enjoy jumping. I think I would jump every other day or I won't jump every day because I don't think that is actually good for your joints or in your knees or not for mines anyway. Uh, but I definitely love the results that I received. I enjoy doing it. Now I want to do a little jump rope and I will be doing some strength weight uh exercising because my upper area is not as strong as I would like it to be. I used to be able to do a push-up or two. I realized I'm not doing push-ups like I used to. So this area is weak. So I need to work on this as for some weights, you know. So if anyone has noticed that they need to work on their upper part of their body as for as strength training, let me know. Put it in the comments. Neo Cell. Um, collagen. I'm still drinking it and so I still have a lot more to go and so I can't exactly tell you uh, what the results is until I actually finish it. So I just want y'all to yes. know. I didn't even notice when I put my uniform on but by the time I got to work and I was sitting there, I realized that my uniform was loose. I was like excited you know and i was so excited to i said i am so glad i waited to do the video because i wouldn't have been able to tell you that i actually lost in inches um i didn't weigh myself in the beginning i didn't measure myself and the times that i thought i was going to measure myself i had retained fluid and i didn't want to measure myself and then give you the measurements and then when the fluid was gone you know, that would have been false information and I don't want to do that. And so I didn't, I didn't get to measure myself, but I definitely want to tell you that yes, you can lose weight and you can lose inches. And if you eat clean, you can do it. You know, it can happen. So if anyone is losing any weight and jumping or any type of exercise, do share with us. Let us know what you're doing. Let us know if you're doing a 30 day jump. Let us know if you just got uh, some excess, uh, a new jump rope. Let us know if you've been jumping for seven days or any type of exercise or challenges that you are doing. Share with us and let us know. The, this is what I was wearing at first. This is what I'm wearing now. I've been, and uh, I would ask y'all to like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And if this is your first time being here, I welcome you and thank you for being here. And any of the return subscribers, if you're here, I thank you as well. All right, y'all. I'll see you all in the next video. And thank you for coming to Healthy Living.